All right, hello. This is a Singed game in Plat 3. We're playing some Spellbook Singed. I'm running Ghosts and Flash, and I'm against a Garen. Uh, I played a Conqueror game later, after this game. This game was played yesterday, all right? And Conqueror just feels like garbage. I, I feel like, I, I don't know how to play with it now. Um, it was already not that great before, but now it's just it just doesn't feel great. I've been having a lot of fun with Phase Rush though. So next video will be Phase Rush Singed. This video is Spellbook because I was like, okay, well I'm against a Garen, so I'm clearly not going to win against him most of the time. And uh, we have a one trick Zed and a one trick Xin Zhao, so they know their champions. I would hope, right? Yeah. So we we just like you know my my thought process is that I want them to get really fed and really really OP and then I can be essentially a support. Right? So the enemy team invades here and it goes one for one. We lose our Senna, they lose their Garen. It's it's okay. Okay, it's it's somewhat of an even trade. Um, only one assist here, but we get four assists, so overall, uh, we should be better in gold, but we aren't. Anyways, so let, let's speed it up. Let's, uh, get to lane really fast. Yeah. And my approach to this lane is just farm. If, if I can kill him before six, that'd be great. If I can get a little bit of damage on him, that'd be great. Sometimes, you know, that doesn't work, right? It's Garen. He doesn't have Dorn Shield, which is kind of interesting, right? Normally, you would start Dorn Shield. And look at that. That QE did a third of my HP. Um, and he didn't even proc Conqueror, right? But, woo, ouch. That hurts. So, we'll just uh, leave it on two times speed. Anyways, uh, Spellbook is... The nerves hurt, right? There's just a bigger cooldown between the uh, what you have to swap with, which is, you know, it, it made sense. Spellbook was very, very strong. And not just for Singed, but f in, like, general for some champions, they used it very, very well uh, to be able to just kind of use it, change, use it. Like, they would, they, would have, they would be able to just swap multiple summoners. They'd have four summoners in a fight. You know, if there wasn't anything happening... They would just like save up. It was it was kind of crazy. Yeah, I get ignited there. I'm fine though, right? I made sure not to take an extra auto. I play with these minions because Garen is dead. I right? get the CS and I back out because I want to spend my gold somewhere. I have 900 gold. I spend it on boots and a uh, and upgrading my pot and also a dark seal pretty worth um we we do want to just kind of sustain through garen's going to out sustain us of course right he doesn't need mana and generally he has a lot of uh hp regen from his passive and usually dorn Sh dorn shield but he doesn't have dorn shield so we just have to worry about his passive we can just keep poking him with a little 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 itty bitty trades and stuff but sometimes that doesn't happen um but so far my bot lane's doing great my mid lane's doing great. My jungle is going all right. Yeah. I'm not too particularly worried about anything that's happening right now. But, you know. Uh, eventually they get rolled. And, um... Senna is tilted for some reason. I'm, I'm not really sure why. I think she was tilted from the, the level 1 invade where she died. And nobody helped her. I got pulled away, okay. But nobody, nobody helped her quotation marks, and that, that's whatever, you know. That, that happens, some people just tilt like that. So a very, very little thing, right? So she keeps getting either picked off or just not paying attention too much. Um, but yeah, this, this lane is just, we farm. All we do is farm. We're not going to try to force anything, because he's going to win, because he is conquer. And uh, I pop barrier here. He ults me, and because I swapped to barrier just a little bit earlier, if you saw in chat, it would have been a minute ago. Oh, it was actually like 10 seconds ago. I pop barrier and I survive. If I didn't have barrier, I would have died because his E chunked through my barrier and his ult and his ignite. 
So he blew on everything for that trying to get that kill and I popped barrier. And this this leads to his downfall because now he doesn't have ignite for a while. Ult is relatively a short cooldown, so he doesn't need to worry about that. But like this is like somewhat of a tilter that you you spent so much like effort into killing this singed and then he pops barrier and like what? Now what? But yeah, we back um we get our ninja tabbies because i see that a lot of them are ad they have a yone they have a fiddlesticks which is not i'm not going to be too worried about he's not going to be focusing me i might run into his ult sometimes when he ults and stuff but it's usually not an issue lucian who might be a problem and he's definitely going to be, going to be focusing whoever's closer to him right and Garen, who does a lot of damage with AD, obviously he's not going to be autoing me as much as some other champions, but, you know, we'll see. Uh, I try to go mid and try to get a gank off, but the, the wave was already kind of pushed, so it was kind of awkward, and it was just unfortunate. Um, I ghost here, I want to kill this Garen, we flip him. Uh, and then I give the kill to Xin Zhao, but he doesn't do enough damage, so I accidentally take the kill, which is fine. We get more stacks on our Dark Seals, which is nice. And let me put on some music. Yeah, at this point, we're doing very, very good. We're up 3,000 gold, which is quite a deficit for the enemy team. Uh, Garen is 1-3. He's not having a good time. Uh, he is going Triforce, and he's doing it correctly by going Phage, into Stinger, into Sheen, and eventually finishing up the Triforce, and then going either Black Cleaver or Tank. Right? So he, he knows how to build, and his name is C9 Garen. Right? So I, I assumed, you know, he knows how to play the game, so I'm like, okay. Oh. Well, yeah. Anyways, we, we dive him, I ground him over here. Um, Zinzo gets a little bit low, right? I'll just kind of, I flash, and I, I just want to kill the Garen, you know? Like, screw it. I have spell book eventually, right? I can, I can just swap things over. So we go for this tower, bonk. Very, very easy, no skill involved. It was a good, great gank by Zinzo. It was amazing. I'm just here to, uh, guide the, the Rift Heralds, um, Sadly, I flipped him a little too close, and he killed it. Uh, we see Yon ult in um, to, I guess, try to kill me, uh, but that doesn't that did that didn't happen. Uh, I I'm not really sure what he was trying to do. Maybe he thought he could clip me with his ult. His ult is like he dashes in a line and he knocks people up. If he clipped me, maybe he could have killed me. Maybe I'm not really sure, but. Yeah, we get a tower, we get Garen, um, it's good. So I start TPing mid because I saw Zed was getting ganked, and I was like, oh, well, I'm out. Because <laughs> Zed died way too fast, and I was window shopping. I'm sorry, Zed, if you happen to be watching this video. But Yon, this Yon is not very good. Uh, I'm not sure if it's the champion, or maybe this guy is new to Yon. I'm pretty sure this guy is just new. Because usually when a new champion comes out for the first like two weeks, his ne his win rate is like negative, like he's like 40% win rate. Because there are so many people trying out the new champion and they have no idea what they're doing. And it's it happens every single time. Yeah? What do you do? What do you, I, don't, I don't know. Because obviously you don't want the ch like they test it on PvE, right? They did nerfs. I think they nerfed Yon multiple times on PBE. Um, so he's obviously okay. Probably. He's probably okay. But we will have to see. I've seen some high level gameplay of Yon, and it was very, very cool looking. And he was using, you know, auto Q, auto E. I don't know. He's just pressing a bunch of skill combos. This is, there's a really. There's like a three minute video of all the combos. It's really, really cool. I recommend you check that out. I'll try to link it if I f remember. Um, please tell me if I forget. Um, if you want to watch it, I'll, let, I'll send it to you or
put in the description or reply to you in the comment. Yeah, anyways, we, we backed just a little bit earlier. We went blasting one because we want to get our Rylai's because Rylai's is really funny. Rylai's will also shut down quite a few people. Um, but yeah, I'm not trying to fight this Garen like at all. There's no point. Like, I can kill him if there's a gank or if he dives me maybe. But I can't solo kill him like that, right? So right now, we're still farming. We're still farming. That's all we gotta do. We just gotta farm, and then if we have a TP, or if someone is close and they're getting ganked, we can help. Right? We are the support. And that, that's just, that's what this game is about. Um, I would be way too squishy if I went full AP, sadly. Garen would be able to just QE me with Justice Triforce, and I would die. Or if Fiddlesticks, Fear, E, W, I'm dead. Like, I needed to be tanky. Like, obviously, there are people who do full AP Singe and stuff, but, you know, you can do that Dark Harvest stuff sometimes, but I feel like sometimes um, it's just not optimal for that situation. And they can definitely prove me wrong, because they're probably higher rank than I am, but I'm, I'm taking the safe route. Uh, I'm not pulling that risk. I know there's a diamond player who goes Dark Harvest, uh, singed every game, and he has like a 52% win rate out of like 300 games, obviously doing well with Dark Harvest AP singed, but I personally, that, that play style, probably not for me. I, I think I like the speed, and I like being sort of like being able to run through a team fight. You know, with no one stopping me. I'm, I'm like a Mundo that's leaving a bunch of fart clouds around. So I'm here. Uh, I don't even think Dragon's coming up or anything, but I, I notice that, you know, people are here. So let's just go in. Let's uh, flip the Lucian and uh, leave him alone, and then we chase after this Yon. Uh, I'm not really sure what he does, um, but we, we'll just... We'll just leave. I'm gonna chase after this Garen. We're cyberbullying this guy. Oh, he flashed. Unfortunate. But it's okay. It's okay. That that the overall fight. We picked up the the Lucian, and uh, everyone else is low. So yeah, this Fiddlesticks is getting a little close. I don't recommend that. Um, Zed just kind of one taps the guy, and then I I flip the the Fiddlesticks. And this game is over. Just kidding. Not yet. You have, you have a little bit of time before that happens. So let's speed it up. I go help Xin Zhao at the red buff. Or, I mean, sorry. Not the red buff. The Rift Heralds. Yeah. And then, um, you know, I wanted to flip this, but this guy does damage. He's very fed. He's a Blade of the Ring King and his jungle item. And I'm guessing he's going either Triforce or what? Black Cleaver? One of those. Anyways, uh, we're back mid because I hope we can do something, but then we go top because we have Rift Herald, remember, and uh, we can get some plates. Just kidding, there's no plates. It's 18 minutes in. Uh, we're just running around this fight. Don't need to do anything. I have my Rallies, so I'm fully slowing them. Um, they are not focusing me at all. It's it's great. It's a great time we're having. Uh, I throw the W down on Fiddlestick so you can't get too close to uh, the Shristana, and we essentially ace them. Uh, this this Garen's running, and then he pops over, and I'm like, okay, well, I'm not. You know, let, let's you know, let's give it a little try. Let's uh, let's chase after him. Let's slow him, and then I flip him, and then I get KS by the support, which is fine because we are support as well. Trisana is still top side um, and she gets away. She wasn't really in any danger so I don't know. I don't know what that was about. But yeah, our focus was that we got the one tricks fed, okay? We we ganked mid, we, we showed up when the jungler needed us, okay? We, we roamed better than the Garen. Garen stayed top the entire game. He was actually kind of crazy. He just sat there. He didn't react. 
I don't, I don't know what that was about. Uh, I had a little little conversation with him like at the end of the the match, and I was like, "Yo, if you need an invite to the Garen Club, I can hook you up." Cause the only requirement to get into the Garen Club, like the club tag, is Garen. It looks very nice. Okay, nice and clean. Um, all you need is 200,000 mastery, and this guy had 600,000, so he had more than enough. So we're doing we're doing Baron. Uh, they clearly know, but they couldn't do anything. They were getting zoned. Uh, we're just gonna run through. I hit Zanya's, and I come back, and I flip Lucian, and I keep going. And then this this is over. Okay, we're super super fast. Cool game. Uh, my thought process was just you know be a nuisance, giant mosquito. How to be annoying. We just keep going with that theme because that's that's what we do best. Giant Mosquito. You know, Giant Mosquito doesn't do very much, but if you leave it alone, it's it's going to cause some issues. I actually didn't know Tristana had exhaust up until this point, because I never looked bot. And I, f I flipped Garen on, onto her because I thought she would do a lot more damage, like one-tap him, but I uh, took two shots. And then I just AFK here. I don't know what happened. Did I fall asleep? <laughs> what happened? Why did I do that? I don't remember. This was yesterday. Yeah, this was the game I played after the Chinese boosters. Or Chinese something. I don't really know. But we just run in and we die. It's fine, dude. I'm just I'm just having fun. I'm trolling around. You know, I get a bunch of assists and stuff. I, I, the game's over. Okay, my team's at the at the gates. Um, Garen can't do anything. He's going dead man's next, which is fine. It's not really. It's not a bad buy. I I, I don't think it's great. But he dies. Zed got really fed. Tristana got really fed. Like this game was doomed. Let's see the gold difference. 7,000 to 10,000, 8,000 to 12,000. This is like a 4,000 to 2,000 gold deficit overall. Anyways, if you enjoyed that, if you enjoyed that video, let me know. Um, if you didn't, hit that dislike button. On, you know, Tell me what I did wrong. Tell me what I should have done. And uh, I will improve my content that way. Because um, people can click on the videos, but sometimes they'll watch it and be like, Dude, this is this suck. This trash. So, um, help me improve my, my content by telling me what I should be doing and what I shouldn't be doing. Yeah. Anyways, uh, stay safe uh, with, with the stuff that's going on outside. And uh, have, have a nice night. And uh, I got a new outro, so we'll, we'll, we'll look at this. This is really cool. And I can talk over it. Um, I put it in through OBS. I'm sorry if it's loud. I think it's loud. Let me turn it down. Anyways, uh, yeah. Use the outro cards for 20 seconds. <laughs>